Let's make a video on honoring where you're at. What do I mean by that? So wherever you are, whatever mental state you are in, I guess it's all about honoring and accepting where you're at and trusting the process and knowing that everything works out the way it's supposed to work out in perfect timing. Not necessarily in your timing or how you expect it to be, but how it's supposed to. Um, I've been practicing effortlessness for some time now, and it might come off as like passive passivity to like somebody who is accustomed to like rushing and running and chasing and doing. Um, but the thing is, I've also experience that aspect of life you know when you're like running around and rushing and doing it every, I don't know chasing and trying and doing doing um, I prefer to just be if that even makes sense I've entered a life where like I just allow myself to be as I am and yes I have moments of laziness and I have moments where I spring into action um, it just depends on you know whatever needs to happen I suppose in the moment but I find that if something takes too much effort and you know tomato tomato everybody has their own way of I guess navigating through life but if it takes too much effort it's almost like you try to force the process. To me, that's 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 a primary sign, predominant sign that you're trying to force the process instead of allow. And at that point, I just kind of um, take rejection as redirection. You know, like if something is like preventing me from doing or attaining something, then I just redirect myself. You know, and I, I kind of like think of nature, you know, like a tree or a leaf floating along the river, the river surface. It, it doesn't like try to force itself to be anywhere or do anything. It just kind of allows life or the river to take it where it needs to go, you know, and same with like like the natural order of things you have like a think about it think about the seasons think about the rising of the sun and the moon think about like just everything like that's the natural cycle of things and it, I think you will agree that man has been living in a very unnatural way which I suppose is part of the process I mean Maybe it's part of the decomposition process, you know, you know like for instance, a, a tree. A tree um, grows leaves and it also drops leaves, you know? And I think maybe we are in that process where the leaf has fulfilled its, its purpose and it goes into decomposition then eventually it drops and then a new leaf forms and you know the the cycle is repeated that that's just how I view things and I don't know like when I was younger and I had more like oomph and more spark in me I definitely was a go-getter <laughs> and I also allowed a lot of things to influence my operating system or my belief systems and now I just kind of like see things as they are and I don't really put put forth too much effort into anything and everything eventually works itself out you know and I just think that's for me currently that's the best way to adopt things when I look back at some of my videos I, I remember I went through a period where I lost interest in a lot of things and maybe that was my way of letting go of outdated systems and programs, operating programs within myself, you know, and so I could like adopt a new way of being and navigating through life, you know, because you obviously cannot, how do 
Let's see. If you are on a particular operating system that no longer is applicable to you, then it would be pretty detrimental for you to continue on that operating system. You know what I'm saying? So in order to update, upgrade, you need to like let go. And I think we haven't been taught that, you know, we grow through stages of our lives and you know, not many people stay stagnant. Some people do. No, actually, I don't think anybody is stagnant. You know, you're, you're constantly moving. It's just, you know, the level of growth may not be as apparent versus somebody who's like really, really like going for it. You know what I mean? But I think like you have some people that grow very slowly, like very slowly, very subtly. And then you have people who, you know, are, the growth rate is fast, you know, and it's very noticeable and it's very obvious. But no, we're all growing, we're all shifting and moving. It's just, you know, at different levels and degrees and dimensions of ourselves. And I think when you have some kind of existential crisis, that's like part of the process of like, you know, adopting a new way of being. That's all it is. I think it's important to just honor where you are and honor like what you're doing in the moment and that's that. It's not that complicated. We make it complicated. Alright, if you learned something great, if you didn't, that's great too. Blessings to one and all. Amen.